Hello, it's friends. Good morning. I want to show you how I am going on with my Bit Bazel project about the stone. It's not a very good point right now because, as you can see, the beadwork has become twisted up on the edges. And so, I think that I need to change the starting point from this kind of bezel. But um, I've taken some pictures uh, because I wanted to show you all the steps uh, that I've done to reach this point. I know that this point it's a mistake, but you know, most of the times uh, while you bead, uh, you learn from mistakes. And so I think that these kind of videos can be very helpful. And if I think about when I was at the beginning of this beading passion, I really would have liked to have this kind of videos uh, to learn. So, the first thing that I have done to go on with the project has been a specific stitch, a sort of a right angle weave stitch. Here you can see the picture, there are these four beads, size 11 seed beads. Then the next step, so that you can see how I have worked, is this one, this picture in here. So you can see there is a sort of a right angle weave technique, but the only difference is that on the top part, I used two beads as one. So instead of adding two more beads on every step, I add three beads on every step because I consider two beads as one. But the final effect was not good enough for me. That's the picture, you can see it's very confused and all the bits have no specific position. And so I decided to change. And I started with this new idea. Starting from my Gutermann bits, size 9 Gutermann bits, I added on a loop two gunmetal size 11 seed bits. Then the next step has been a size 11, just like a peyote stitch. So nothing very complicated. And I went on like this until the end of the round. Then my idea was to connect all these gunmetal seed beads with the black seed beads of these last rounds. And that's where the problem appeared. Right now I want to change the starting point, not only because there is no possible solutions, but because there are always possible solutions when you bead. But it's because I'm bother. <laughs> I bother about this piece of beadwork. I want to change it. I want something different and uh, I'm tired of focusing about this kind of problems on this kind of beadwork. So sometimes beading it's also like this. Changing something just because you are not enjoying the things you are doing in that specific moment. So for now that's all. I hope that this video can be helpful. Thank you for watching. Have a nice bidding day. Bye bye.